Okay, so we're going today for another Cosmic Scout Classics, and today it'll be Putt and Putter for the Sega Master System from 1992. Yes, another early 90s game that I played when I was younger. Right, so one player, and we're on the first hole. Oh, right, okay, I remember this. Uh, click where I want to go. Ooh, right, there's a power bar. Aiming it in the power bar. And let's see. Ooh, almost, almost. Oh, I guess I'm going to have to take another shot to get this in. There we go. Birdie. That's not bad. Birdie. One under, birdie. Cool. Right. So we're now on. Well, stage two, obviously. It seems like this orange bit of sand that slowed me down last time. And it moves. So it's pushing me next to the hole. Hmm. I got no. That's not bad as well. Take my wee second shot there. Get another wee birdie. This seems to be going quite well so far. I'm not wanting to jinx myself, but right. If I remember correctly, I have to hit this switch in order to turn off the moving sand. The hole's over there. Right, let's go. Let's try and hit this switch first and see if we can. Do it fast. Oh well, that worked out better than I expected. But as you can see in this game, they use well, they use this power bar. And ooh, birdie! Yes, I'm doing fucking amazing at this game. I forgot how good uh, how easy this game is. Well, no, no, the game's not easy. I'm just fucking good at it. Right, next hole. Sorry, yeah, I went away on a tangent there because I was winning. Right, another switch. Another fucking another pain in the arse. Oh, looks like I can fall off this one. The wee bits that are like intersecting the red, where there's no barrier. So yeah, but like I was saying, the power bar. This was one of the earliest versions of a game that did it because you needed to think of a way and how to how to move with limited ability because it wasn't to later on in the Tiger Woods games that you could then use an analog stick to do it. That was years later. We're talking PlayStation 2. So we're talking 10 years later, eight, 7 years later or something to remap controls for golf games, something like that. So we're doing, we're doing alright in this game so far. Uh, we're, yeah, we're touching switch, we Okay, I don't think we want to hit that switch. I think that will turn stuff back on if I hit that. Okay, just be gentle. Sometimes you have to... It's not all about just hitting it as hard as you can. Sometimes you have to try and... Have a wee bit of finesse. And try not to hit these switches. Ooh. Because of the angle there, I thought I was going to hit that. But I never, so let's go again. That was... Oh, should have really gotten. Oh, oh, are you kidding? Right, let's try that again. We've got to get him from here. Yeah, we did. Yeah, it's like the same effect with the water as it is in games this time, and it's just like two different images that switch back and forth. Ooh, ooh, no! Yeah, you made it up. And it didn't fall off in one shot. Right. Yes. So, flip the switch and I'll go. Power bar. Let's. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that was close. I almost turned that switch back on and killed myself. But yeah, the water's like in games like this because of graphical power. It's just two pictures going back and forth to make it look like water. It's the same as the sand, really. The sand's just energy's going. back and forth to make it look like it's moving. If I hit this off this corner, I should be able to bounce around it. Yep. Oh, am I going to get in the hole this time? No. Well, that's not bad. I landed pretty much aiming straight onto the hole. So I'll probably be able to get it in. Yep. Um, I'm bad. Oh, bonus stage? I don't remember bonus stages. Well, that doesn't look easy to get to. Right. Let's try... 
go on at this angle, see what happens, but no, no, definitely not, no, definitely not, that's the, the, just completely wrong. I ended up close to the hole, but I don't go in the hole, let's try it from a better angle, go through this wee gap and see what happens. Oh, I think that was a bit of a bug there because it sort of just jumped to the hole. I mean, we can try that again. See if that works again. Well, it did. Yeah, there's some sort of bug there. It seems like I can just hit it through that gap, hit off that part of the wall, and it just sort of gravitates towards the hole. Oh, okay. Well, that it's a kind of easy level now that I can do that. If I just continue to try and get this right. Oh, I think I might have started at the wrong kind of angle there. Yeah, I don't know if this one will, I don't think this one will go in. Nah. I think I've clicked the box a bit too far to the right. Ooh, I've got five bonus balls there. Okay. This looks simple. There must be something... Ah. An in-out portal. Nothing else. Is there anything down this way? No, no. Hmm. Seems quite simple. In the portal, out the portal. Okay, let's try it. The walls also remind me of Sonic. I don't know if why, like, but the Genesis Stroke Mega Drive version of Sonic. I don't know if this is just the default for bricks at the time, but it seems to be that way. It just that just seems like the default for the bricks is. What the hell was I trying to do there? Really? Really? That was that was the worst shot on the planet. Well, maybe not on the planet. It was probably the worst shots on the planet, but... Yeah, that's because that terrible shot I, I missed through the bogey. But I've still got 10 balls. Really, I don't want to go into this portal because it's going to mess me up. Okay, let's try and go round the portal. Oh, well, that... I didn't manage to go round the portal then. And unfortunately I can't go back through it because it's an in and out and not a... Well, it's not really a portal, it's an in and out. Right, let's go back up here. Oh, right, okay. I should be able to get through this gap without going in that water. And I did... Ah, oh, yes! Par. Even though I've messed it up with that portal. Right, next level. We'll see what happens here. There's an out portal there, which is weird. Right, come down here. Well, there's the hole. There's an out portal there. Water there. Right, go. Ooh, ooh. Awesome. Ah, that wasn't as. I thought that was going to go the way I wanted it. I need to try that again. That's. I don't know if it counts as two shots. Let's see what's happening. Ooh, ooh. Oh. Well, that was a bit shite. I guess it's not that one I need to go to then. If I hit it here, will this put me down the ramp? Ooh. Oh, it's put me through the same portal again. <sighs> right, so... And I don't know how I went in the water there, but I did go in the water, so that's a bit... fun for me. <sighs> Fucking hell. Excuse my language, but this is... Come on. Yep. Try that one again, Cosmic. And that is just an awful shot again. Come on. I think that's... Yeah. Just stay there, that's happening. No, don't go for that portal. Go for that one. Yes. Get through there. And I think, ah, uh, what? Give up? I didn't give up. Ooh, five over. Ooh, I lost a lot of balls there. That was not good. Right, okay. I'm guess just hit, I'm just gonna hit it and hope. See what happens. I mean, uh, uh, don't stay up there. Stay up there. Don't go back down. Right, okay. 
I was a bit stupid to hit and hope, but well, actually, so it kind of worked out. I'm just not gonna. Right now, I need to try and get up here without going too hard and bouncing back down, or without going too soft and bouncing back down, or rolling back down. Try that one again. Right, so we're up. No, no, no. Ooh, ooh. I don't want to have to go all the way back down. And perfect. That was that was absolute perfect. Right, okay. If I miss this hole, there's a good chance it's gonna bounce off all those things and put me back down. <gasps> Ooh, I was lucky, look how close that is. That must be like a few pixels off. And we're in. Oh, really? It was still a bogey. Down to four balls. Next stage, right. Yes. It's a good idea. Look to see where the hole is. Okay. Seems pretty see easy place. Oh, I suppose I could get stuck down there forever. Down the other side. I could get stuck down there forever, so... Yeah, the, the issue is... They had a really limited computing power. So, they had to think up clever ways of doing stuff. Like the power bar, which... If you look at the power bar, it's now incorporated into a lot of golf games for phones and stuff like that because it is a simple way of doing it and it works you get the power bar up you hit it hard you get the power bar low you hit it soft and that didn't do great there don't just don't go down for the more oh that was close right how am i supposed to that's oh yeah that's a good angle actually that shows me going at a good angle uh oh I didn't take into consideration the that rolling down the hill as it went up the hill. If you know what I mean? Like I didn't take into consideration it doing the right thing. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, uh. Really? This is like snooker games of this the same time had the kinda the same idea where it would be I'd show you where the ball was going. You had the power bar to how hard it was hit. And there we go. We got in. Wait, that was a par. How was that a par? How many? I was. It was supposed to take five. So a par basically means if you're. It's supposed to take five shots to do it. You get in in five shots. That's a par. A birdie is if it's supposed to take five shots and you do it in four shots. An eagle is if it's supposed to take five shots and you do it in three shots and then you get an albatross which is if you take two sh if it's supposed to take you five shots to do it and it takes you two and then a hole in one's kind of self-explanatory it's if you get it in the hole in one shot so that's kind of that's the rules of oh i got a bit distracted there that was close. That was almost. I don't know because it doesn't actually. Oh, it does tell you how many shots you're supposed to get in, it. and it's in the birdie. See, so probably four shots now got in and three. No, five shots now got in and four. So that's why that happened. That's why it's a birdie. Right. Okay. Another bonus stage. I don't think this one's going to glitch the same way it did before. So if I. I need to try and find a way. Ooh. If I try and get through this wee gap, we'll see. Can I get through that gap? It doesn't seem like I can get through that gap. We'll just hit and hope, hit and hope. Because this is how I get the bonus balls. Okay, this is, this is just gone. These will disappear eventually, I believe. Right, okay. And then bounce, bounce, bounce. Well, I mean, at least the ball had fun. It went away in a wee journey. Uh, but we thought that didn't work, so we'll try something different. Oh, I think that's going to go. Ooh, that was close. Maybe that's the right idea. I was close. Try it again. Oh, I missed it. That was a wee bit different. And now I'm in that pattern again. But I'm just bouncing around the whole thing. 
We're gonna hit the other side of that. Yeah, look at that. I'm bouncing right round and hitting the same one. So yeah, that I tried to do the same thing there, but I got a bit impatient and just was like, just hit it. I want you to just hit it, but you know, you get angry when you just hit stuff. I mean, that's a good thing about some golf games. Like you can just, when it comes down to it, you can just smack stuff. Especially, ooh, that was so close. That was so close to just, just a bit too much power. That's what happens when you try too hard. That's what happens when you hit it too hard. No, this one's just, I just can't. This one's just not doing it for me. I just can't find the glitchy bit in this. <laughs> I can't find the glitchy bit in this one. So I can't do it. But yeah, whoa, that was a weird bounce. That ball looks like it's having fun. Bouncing all around there like that. And none in. Oh! I guess I'm, this is like a bridge I'm supposed to hit. If I'm, mm, yeah. Yeah, cool. It was a bridge I was supposed to hit. Ooh! That was, that was not meant. I'm telling you right now, that was luck. And we got in, and it was a birdie. Fantastic! That means it was... I never lost a ball. I got a roll because I got it in under par, so I got an extra ball. That was just pure luck that I got that in there. Wait, this one's now moving around. Does it move all the way around? Oh no, okay. It just moves round in that kind of L shape. So it doesn't float round the whole the whole island the whole zone. But I have to time this perfect, otherwise I'm gonna go into the water. And birdie again. Awesome, I have now have 17 bottles. So this is, these, I'm doing, I think I'm doing better on these ones than I was on the, the easier ones. This is a further hole. And we knocked down another bridge and bounced a bit far back. I'm guessing that's the in, there's the out. Ooh, right, okay, there's no barrier as you can see on the end of that. So if I hit it too hard, it's just going to roll right off the edge. If I I also need to time it for that bridge. Yep, and that's perfect. I'm getting better at this. I believe I will just bounce off this corner and that will bounce me around. And we'll just kind of see if the hole is there. And it was, because, well, I guess, where else would that hole be? I mean, and we got in par and we get a wee tune going. And I'm happy. Because I've got 17 balls. Okay, another bridge, door bridge. Door bridge? Yeah. Drawbridge! Ah, well, I could have done better there. I could have hit it just a slightly softer so that when I came down it, it seems to be disappearing when it goes over the bridge. Right, we'll have to go and see where we have to go. Right, the hole's there. So it's not difficult to get to the hole. Ooh, that looks like a good angle. That was a brilliant angle. But, oh, there's no edge there. Ooh, that was close. That worked out for a while. Sometimes you just have to hit and hope. And, like, especially golf games like this, it's like you just have to get the right angle, the right power. There's less... Less that can go wrong. Right, so what's happening? Ooh, right, okay. I guess, where's the hole? Just I think I'd get over this and then I should be fine. Okay, so that's two. And the, the hole's right in that corner, so if I get the right angle here, I can just go straight up and straight into the hole. Okay, it wasn't the ideal angle, but should be straightforward from now. Yep, and we're in the birdie again. Yes. But yeah, as you can see from all the levels I've been on, the water's kind of been the same. Like the water inside on the course is just dark blue, a dark blue color. There's all the, ooh, not too much. Damn it. Yeah, like I was saying, the, the water on the course seems to be a dark blue and then the water outside 
of the course is like two kind of the two kind of pictures that just change between the two of them so that it looks like water it doesn't really look like water but you can tell it's supposed to be water that was actually I couldn't have actually done that any better there but yeah Sometimes I'm losing my concentration because I'm have to try and talk to you folk or talk to myself because you're not really here. But anyway, yeah, so we'll go straight up. Oh, okay, I just I didn't need that little do thing. Oh, a bogey? No. Oh yeah, it was a bogey. Six. I was supposed to get in a five and I got in the six. Oh, okay. I guess that's us. I remember that being longer. I remember that being a longer game. I don't even know. I must have finished that with a lot of balls. I mean, once I've finished recording, once this is up, I, once I'm editing this, I'll check. Because I think I finished with a lot more balls than I needed to. But yeah. This guy, this guy is just not very good at this whole walking thing. He needs to get a grip. I'm guessing that's the flag. And he jumped in the hole. Yay! And that's us. So I think that's us. Yeah. Putter Putter from 1992. Wasn't a very long game. In fact, it was quite short. But we finished it. Frustrated. But it was good. It was good. Definitely good. We had fun. Anyway, that's another Cosmic Cult Classics. Catch you next time.